Hi, my beauties. I just made a video, but I don't know. I just feel like I need to make another one about a different topic. And it's about masturbation. And I just think that we need to talk about it. So let's talk about it. I'm really targeting my women here, but men, you can listen in too. But yes, women, yes, we struggle with lust. We struggle with pornography. We struggle with masturbation. I myself used to struggle with pornography. I myself still struggle with masturbation. And I myself still struggle with lust. I do. And this is something that I did not want to like share because it's like, oh my gosh, I feel so, so ashamed, but it's like, I ain't the only one, you know, when you know that you're not the only one, you can share it. And I feel like when God helps me, when God leads me to do something, I need to do it because it could be an encouragement to somebody else. Yes, as a child of God, I struggle with lust because yes, I still live in a fallen, even evil world. So yes, of course I struggle with lust. Yes, I used to struggle with pornography really bad. I'm a year free. Hallelujah. Uh, and currently I still struggle with masturbation. Haven't done that in a while either, but I still struggle with it. It's still something that I'm struggling to let go of. And so the thing about it is even even when you let go of doing certain things, that does not mean that the desire stop. That does not mean that you're not going to want to watch pornography or masturbate anymore or you're not going to um, be thinking about, you know, just lusting. And so I just want to say that, yes, females, women, uh huh, we struggle with lust, too, because I feel like so many times it's just like, oh, men struggle with lust. No, it's women, too. Yeah, women watch pornography. Men, I mean, not men, men, too, but <laughs> women masturbate as well. Women struggle with having sex outside of marriage as well. I myself have not had sex, out, sex outside of marriage, but that doesn't matter because I'm still sinning regardless. And no sin is greater than the other. Every sin is the same. It's bad point by period and so i just want to come on here and say if you're struggling with masturbation pornography do not be afraid to tell a trusted friend um me personally i just think that it's important for me to share this with y'all because yes you know you see a pretty girl on the outside like dang like she look like she pure and stuff like that no let me tell you something yes i'm pure in the lord but the lord is restoring my purity back to me because there are some decisions that i have made that i'm not proud of and so many times we judge the person Oh, they had sex outside of marriage and stuff like that. Well, baby, you still masturbate. You cannot be judging people when you are still stuck in sin too. Like, we should not be condemning each other. We should be helping each other. You know what I'm saying? We should be praying and uplifting each other. There are demons and battles that we fight, that our brothers and sisters fight, that we should not be judging because we understand how it feels to be in their shoes. I know how it feels to um struggle with pornography addiction because I was explored, exposed, I said exploring, I was exposed to porn at a young age so i know how that feels to struggle with porn i know how it feels to struggle with masturbation i know how it feels to struggle with lust and sexual imageries and fantasies and stuff like that and it's not that you want to struggle with it but like i said we still live in an evil fallen world we still do and so i just wanted to share that with y'all i pray that that encouraged somebody it really took me a lot um of bold and i know i'm always bold when i come on this app because like of course i'm the ambassador of christ jesus you know but at the end of the day that would that was still kind of hard for me to you know tell y'all because that's not nothing like you you know you're proud of like oh i struggle with masturbation i struggle with you know sin i struggle with lust but i just feel like by me saying this to y'all i pray that somebody else get encouraged and understand that you're not the only person going through this especially my women women you are not the only one going through this okay it's okay to say yes me i struggle with masturbation you can never fix a problem if you never acknowledge that you have one and so i just pray that by me telling y'all that yes i struggle with it too so don't feel alone i just pray that by me saying that i pray that it encourages you to be honest with God, and it's not that I had to share it with y'all because the Lord already know, but I just want to share it with y'all because of the simple fact. I know there's some sisters and brothers out there that struggle with the same thing and they're like, oh, I feel ashamed to talk about it. Well, let me tell you something. I'm not ashamed to talk about it because I know the Lord going to help me, okay? And the Lord going to help me and the Lord going to help you and we going to all get help. You know what I'm saying? We all going to get help regardless. And so this is nothing to be ashamed about, okay? You have to acknowledge that you have a problem in order to fix it. And so I just want to let y'all know that, yes, even people in Christ Jesus, yes, we struggle with lust, masturbation, sexual intercourse. We struggle with it too, okay? We are still human beings, okay? So I just wanted to say that and I just want to let y'all know that you 
you will be delivered from it. Declare it over yourself. I'm healed. I'm freed. I'm delivered from it. Don't say I'm still stuck because you're not. You have to fight back with the word of God and understand that this is not your portion. You are not meant to be stuck unless you're not meant to keep going back to that same relationship that leaves you broken and stuck. You're not meant there. You're not meant to be there. You have to declare yourself free. Be free. Be delivered. Because that's what the Lord declares over you. You are free. You have to believe it and you have to walk in it. So, I love y'all and I pray that this video blessed y'all. And yes, be free. Don't go back. Please, do not go back. <laughs> but yes, I love y'all and I'll see y'all in my next video.